Ladies and gentlemen, welcome again. Our third place game is coming up in 10 minutes. Igokea, Tofash Bursa. Uh, last year they were the finalists, but this year, 2024, they have to play just for the bronze medal because all the two teams uh, were beaten in the semi final. Team Ritas Vilnius bet with an excellent game in an excellent game with a wonderful performance the team Igokea the team from Bosnia and Herzegovina and the Tofas Bursa suffered a loss against team Galatasaray there was a domestic Turkish battle and at last the team Galata with a ruled the whole game and uh, they were the better and first time in their history they are in the final but we have before the final bronze match game i don't know if it's too disappointed team i think so but one of them will be very very happy at the end because uh, the bronze medal is going to put around their neck uh, ritas fieldius igoka as you can see 83 76 and on the other side more than 20 point victory by the galatasaray against the tofash the team from istanbul was pretty efficient during the whole game and it was a well-deserved win on the other side as i mentioned there was a brilliant match against uh, the ritas vilnius and both teams would have deserved to qualify to the final but this is sport only one can be the winner and it was the team from vilnius lithuania Last year it was a 73-66 victory achieved by the Igokea. The first edition located in Bursa, Turkey and the home team then, Team Bursa, got the silver medal. Now, as you can see, Radosic is not on the, the squad. Actually, I don't know what happened because uh, I didn't see anything serious about uh, him but uh, maybe it was the coach's decision the main point is that uh, team Igokea will play without his best uh, player Ognjen Radosic who last year was the second top scorer the second sharpshooter of the match now the official presentation is coming up so I'm handing over the stage to my friend Fisto Baranyi our public announcer and then I'm coming back Players just shaking each other's hands, wishing good luck to the opponent. And 
Jovicic, the captain of the Igoka, is not on the in the squad either, as you could see on the TV screen as well, because uh, the last game against the Ritas, he got injured, and how I see uh, his shoulder is bended up, so that's why he cannot play. Wishing him a fast regeneration. So without Jovicic and without uh, Radosic, the Igoka uh, is uh, uh, with, uh, without two players, but uh, I guess that uh, they are still very, very strong without these two talented guys. And uh, they are fighting how I know the Balkanic mentality. I mean, it's a positive uh, uh, attitude. Uh, they are very strong mentally as well and fighting till the end. And uh, even they cannot defend the title, it's not the same if it's a bronze medal or just a fourth place. This can be the situation on the other side as well. Tofash Bursa last year, silver medalist want to have a revenge against the Igokea. I guess need no extra motivation to them to fight for the medal and for the victory as well. Last year, as I mentioned, it was a 73-66 win. Dusan Makitan was the MVP. He is not here, actually. And let's see for the referees, Peter Proch, Hungary, Alan Dos Santos, Brazil, and Yasmina Alcaraz from Spain. So they, uh, that time Dusan Makitan was the MVP and the uh, 15 points, they was, he was the best. And on the other side, Özgür Cengiz, who was the top scorer of the whole tournament. Ömer Engin, Batu, Eriutlu, Enes Akman, Emirhan, Serbest, and Efe Postel. Starting five by coach Topalolu. And uh, the two top scorers meet, met in the final. And although Cengiz scored 26, Makitan 15, but the final, uh, the main point was the full uh, match. And the Igokea won with seven points. Ognjen Perisic, Andrei Buleta, Faruk Duvnyak, Vasily Stoic, and Andrei Acimovic. The lineup for the Igokea, named by Boris Jokanovic, head coach of Igokea. And uh, from that team, from fi last year's final team, Radosic was there, but as I mentioned to you, ladies and gentlemen, now he is not here, but uh, Vasilya Kuridza and uh, Andrei Acimovic and Andrei Vuleta played that time as well from the team of Igokea. On the other team, the Tofash from that team, Ömer Engin, the captain of the team, was there in that final, just like Batu Eriutlu. But the rest of the players are new in the Tofash, and uh, they created a brand new team, almost a brand new team, just without, uh, just with two players from the 2023 edition, Eriutlu and the captain Engin. And Serbest was the third. White jersey team Igokea with a bit red and uh, blue and green jersey team Tofash Bursa. We do hope that we are going to have a brilliant match and uh, full of excitement. This is our second last game here in Debrecen the second last of the Youth Basketball Champions League 2024. Good luck to all the teams and let's have a wonderful show. After a tip-off, Team Bursa is 
coming with the first attack. Almost a steal by Akman. And they grabbed it. For free. Almost. Got the rebound. Once again, once again, two per two, excellent triples. And Engin, now it's a private battle between the two players, or now it's a Engin and the Duvniak show. Out, Buleta, try to save it. No score by Perisic. One. Fast break. Erin Flu. No triple. Postel. Erin Flu. Wonderful double. And now it's 10 5. And the fast timeout called by Jokanovic. There was a pretty soft defense, and as you can see as well, Boris Jokanovic is pretty angry. Absolutely understandable. Make they have uh, he has to make an order in the heads as well. I think. I don't know if they are under motivated or not, but I hope they're no. Because okay, it's not a gold medal game, but it's not the same how you go home with a medal or without. Back to the game. For a triple, not now, by Duvniak. Postel. Engin. Postel. Almost. So 
Dubňák, tu Ačimovič. Out. Then the second is in. Kurija is coming for first. Winner of last year. He was there in the final. Hang him. For free. Absolutely insane. Now it's 13-7. Uh, Tofas Bursa, absolutely motivated. Perisic, then Duvniak. Acimovic, pretty cool handed guy, but now it's out. And there was a foul. Engin get, gets the personal foul. Duvňák. Duvňák Ačimovič by his own. Good decision, nice point. Eriut Lum. Almost a steal by Vuleta. From the other side, Akman. Now it was a bit short, Vuleta. Acimovic, Duvniak. Pretty, pretty slow attack. Duvniak. Nice score and a good assist. Perisic. First point. Erutlu, Serbest, pass in, Erutlu, it was a clever shoot, but Serbest right there with the rebound, for free, out. Akman once again, nice pass, they need to shoot right now, out. Achimov, Perisic could not get back, Engin. To Akman, there's another chance for free. Akman, offensive rebound, they, they have it. Postel. Nice screen. Postel on the way alone. And the foul. Substitution for Igo Kea, Micho Milovanovic, and for the Tofas as well. Gunul. Postel. 15-11. Leg. Achimovic. <laughs> Perisic for free. Bit wide. Kurija with the rebound. Milovanovic. Wonderful triple. Who else but Duvniak? Answer. 
and Postel. Two pointer that was. Kurija, good defense, Postel. Engin, easy basket. 19 14. Duvniak to Achimovic. Out. Achimovic with his own rebound that he feels very comfortable under the ring. Engim. Postel is out right now. Achimovic with a free to tie the game. Now he's with eight points. Postel. Step back three shots, but it's out. Milovanovic. with the foul. Jurdjevic and Stoic are up, just like Basharan. Talented point guard. Stoic. Out. Serbest with the rebound. One of the best rebounder is Serbest from the whole field. Eliud Lu to the other side. Wow! It's Gunul. Great three pointer, 22 18. Out. Switch. Out, out once again. Basharan. Now the fast break. Postel scores. Djurdjevic. Thirteen foul. Team Tofash. No score. Gunnar uh, Gunn with the rebound. Then Serbest also, Buleta. Oh, like this effort. No score either, Milovanovic. Many, many chances missed. Postel. Nice score. Good finish. Eight points lead. In the second one, Kurija. Basharan. Erutlu. And it's over, ladies and gentlemen, after 10 minutes. We have a pretty good game, I guess. Uh, you under I hope you understand with me. Igokea Tofash 2026. 20, Many chance missed by team Igokea, especially under the ring. If it's not Achimovic, the other uh, all the other uh, players missed many chances. They have to improve.
they have to improve in the statistics, I guess. Uh, two turnovers and one, and four and five assists. Uh, the Tofash was a bit more precise in every aspect, but there's just a small difference between the uh, two teams, I guess. And some highlights on the screen. Duvniak was the most efficient player with his triples, staying the team alive. We have some big names just in uh, front of us and around us because the team Debrecen, first division basketball uh, team's coach, Anja Komandic, uh, head coach of the team Debrecen, just sitting around me, and also Djorti Trenovac, one of the key players of the team Debrecen, also from Serbia. He's a top scorer in the team Debrecen, actually, senior division. And first, of course, first division team. Kurija in. The first two points, four points now, belongs to Igokea. And the answer by Akman. Stojic, Kurija from the corner, out. Again, Oy! that was a big crash. I hope there won't be any problem. Milovanovic goes there, very fair. To check if he's ready or not. Seem so good, but I hope, yeah, he's okay. He's standing right now and he's waiting for the ball by the Spanish referee, Yasmina Alcaraz. Basharan. Engin. Basharan. Serbest. No score. Jurjevic and the steal by Basharan. Jurjevic. Out. Kurija blocked. Basharan. Engi, nice pass back. And Gunul. There's another timeout. Absolutely understandable. What is Jokanovic? Hold the timeout. And it's a 33 24 7 0 rush by Tofas. They are now in a positive flow. And Boris Jokanovic need to stop this mood and wake their players up, his players up. Duvniak, Dachimovic 8-8, eight, eight, Kuridra with 6 points.
11 for, uh, from 28 field goals percentage. It's not a lot. Milovanovic, Achimovic, Kurija for free. Achimovic grabs it back, then Kurija is arriving. Now it's like a rugby match. Milovanovic. <laughs> oh my god. No possession at all, for us, but the last, <laughs> last 30 seconds was pretty insane. The guys fighting for the ball. Just crashing to each other. Basharan. Their best. Now, Kurija. Duvniak. Team foul and personal foul to Tofas. Gönül. First team and personal foul. Gönül could not believe it. Duvniak is on the line. He can reach the 10. Now he has 8 points. The first is out. Second is good right now. Akmam. Serbest. Engin. Akman saved it. Basharan. Where is the ball? There is the ball. Good pass and a fast uh, Duvniak point. Now it's six point lead to Tofash. Out. <coughs> By Gönül. Stoic from the corner, Kurija. Oh, that's a wonderful triple. And this is now a six point rush by Team Igokea. As a result, Chaner Topalolu, head coach of Tufas Bursa, called a timeout. They're not in trouble, but the Eagle K is just approaching them. Meter by point by point, minute by minute. And the bet is the bronze medal.
So back to the game, ladies and gentlemen, after the timeout. It's a three-point lead to Team Tofash. And Basharan is advancing the ball. Serbest. To Postel, he came back to the game. Serbest with the rebound. Basharan <coughs> fighting for the... Looking for the teammate or with a triple. It's out of the ring. Strange offensive play. Achimovic for free. Out. Postel with the rebound. Engin. Nacimovic with two shots. First is out. Second is good now, it's just a two point lead. See what can be the decision. Postel to touch the ball, maybe Achimovic or Postel. decision actually but in this key match in every key situation is very very important uh, it's a white ball So it was the Postel who touched the ball last. Yet. Achimovic blocked 
Achimovic once again. It's out. Achimovic for the third. Can't because Eric is right there. Basharam. What a tough game we have, and good to see that the team Igoka is now playing with fire. Basharan, but I guess the opponent is more concentrated and playing with less uh, mistakes. It's another easy two pointer, six point lead. Stoic, score in. Basharan. Trick that was Servest in the hunt. Nice double by Postel. Kurija. Brilliant movement. Basharan. Postel. Engim. Nice trick, Serbest. But there is a traveling. The Brazilian, re Brazilian referee to stood there with the right angle. Jurjevic to Kurija. No triple. Engin. And two. Oh, what a good cross in. And Engin. Now he is with 13 points. Oh, there was an air ball by Stoic. A bit more than two minutes to go from the first half, but it is a very exciting and very interesting and uh, entertaining match, fortunately. Sad to know that we are almost at the halfway. Basharan advancing the ball up. Servest. Basharan. Engin to Eriutlu. No triple. Vucenovic with the rebound. Stoic. Oh, there was a lot. Nice. Turning down, but that it was imp impossible to catch by Kurija. Substitutions. Postel. In from the corner, a bit short. This is a postel. What a pass inside. Eriutlu scores. Now it's a 
point lead. 13 foul, Tofash. Triple. First missed after a long time by Duvniak. Engin. Two shots in the sec the 13th foul to team Igokea. Two shots, but before as a substitution. Galic. First is good by Engin, sharpshooter of the Tofash, the captain of course. The second is out. Forty one seconds. Maybe two attacks. And Vucenovi uh, Milovanovic forced uh forced the uh, two shots to Akman. Two shots for team Igor Kea to approach a bit. First is good by Milovanovic. His first point. And the second is in, two. Hang him. No score, but there's a foul. for both sides. Perisic is coming up. And Gönül for team Tofash. First is out. Seconds is a fast attack. Duvniak blocked and the shooting foul. Basharan is so sad about it. Eriot Luvas who blocked, but it was not correct. So Galic with it. Three attempts. The first is out. The 
Second is good. And one more chance to come closer. The third is also, so it's now six points lead. And back go oh, almost. Ladies and gentlemen, the first half is over. And the Tofash Bursa is uh, leading almost the whole way. And now they have a six points lead against the last year's winner, Igor Kea. Uh, the 50 minutes uh, break is coming, and then we are coming back. We have a wonderful game, so stay with us after the break. At halftime, Igor Kea, Tofash, 39-45.
Back to the game, ladies and gentlemen. The second half start just a couple of seconds ago, and the first point by Eri Utlu. Uh, 47 39, it's a eight point lead to team Tofas Bursa last year's runner up. This, is, uh, this uh, pair was the final last year. Then, the, that time, the team Igokel won with seven points. 73 66 now they are uh, the leaders uh, with eight points uh, and get uh, they are on the way to get to, re to give a uh, revenge to the team eco the reigning champion team eco misses two play uh, players Ognia Radosic, the maybe the top scorer of the team and also the captain uh, Jovicic and uh, this can be a bit disadvantage to the team, but at all the statistics are uh, uh, means a lot and uh, say, uh, say a lot to us. And uh, more than 12% uh, uh, more efficiency from the field achieved by the Tofash, and this can be a key factor. And this Eriutl triple as well, first time in the game, it's more than 10 points difference 50 39 Milovanovic Achimovic Guleta no triple Kurija with the rebound Jersey Postel, no score but two shots. The first team foul for Igo Kea. Scored 12 points. Is scoreless for a first minute, but good defense. Guleta and Achimovic together. Duvniak, Guleta, triple point. Guleta, first point.
Tabuleta once again. No score either. Let's see the fast break. Engin. To Akman. Engin. There's a foul by Kurija. It's his first foul. He's the best with uh, Bugniak with for, uh, 11 points. Commentator is in danger. I was almost got a ball to my face. on the line back to the 10 point yes Perisic nice steal again Eriut Lu Postel Akman easy point and it's a timeout called by Boris Jokanovic head coach of Igoka absolutely understandable because Igokea's machine does not work right now. And for the first free, first three minutes, they scored uh, only three points with a three pointer by Vuleta. And on the other side, it's uh, nine by the opponent, the Turkish team. And Tofaj Bursa uh, seems uh, more uh, structured and uh, more focused. And we can see on the r result, because it's 12 points difference. Catch the ball, but then Eriutlu arrived. <laughs> Team Igoka must uh, reorganize itself. Mentally and physically too. If they want to get the victory out. Milovanovic. Bubniak, Milovanovic, three pointer! <laughs> Below 10, and now almost a good defense. Postel out, and Kurija gets it. Uh, then Duvniak, nice movement, brilliant point. Now it's a seven from the 12, 5 0 rush by Team Igokea. Akman, Serbest, Engin, facing with uh, Perisic for a triple, no triple, and there was a foul. Personal foul, personal foul, personal foul, personal foul. 
fourth team foul. Called to Achimovic. Oh, he gets Postel back. What an. That's a very surprise decision by Duvniak to give the ball post uh, to Postel. Duvniak to correct his uh, mistake and he does it. For two, it's out. Perisic. Milovanovic. Engin with a foul. Substitution. Basharan is coming and Gönül. For the other side, Duvnyak out. And Djurjevic in. No fail. <clears throat> Basharam. Serbest left the ball. Kurija. Kurija out of the ring. Postel. Gönül. Achimovic stopped him. Postel for free, wide open. No score, and Achimovic grabs the ball. Now the top has stopped a bit. Kurija. Milovanovic. Achimovic for free. No free, but great rebound by Milovanovic. And there's a foul by Gönül. Two shots. Third team foul. Team Tofash. Milovanovic was so brave and so useful. First, there was a rebound, and then forced to. Have the two point opportunity. The first is good. They are at 50. Approached it. The second is perfect, too. Five point difference from the 12. Basharan. Nice steal by Perisic. And the score, and it's a timeout. It was absolutely expected by Chaner Topalolu, head coach of Tofash, because it's now a big rush and now just three points different. And if uh, the Igokea tasted the blood, or taste the blood, they will grab the victory, I guess, regarding uh, the mentality. They are great fighters. Also, the Turkish part is the same. And now there's a. They are now a bit down, how I feel, uh, and how we see the points hasn't come for a while, but. It was time to call the timeout and then just reorganize the game and the play. They are still the leaders. They have to glance back too. Because uh, now Igoka is very, very close.
Foster now with a free. No answer yet. Gunul is the punch to his face. No time for a stop. Foster once again, one of the most useful players to Gunul. Triple time once again. The timeout worked perfectly. Six points in a row. And now from three to nine points. Great answer by Pericic. Six points. Gunul. Basharan, what a pass was it inside to Eriot Lou from the paint. Milovanovic. Milovanovic. Perisic. Milovanovic for free. For free! Brilliant game by Milovanovic with 10 points. Now it is his best. Against the Nimburg, uh, he scored 13, but uh, against the Rida 6, uh, Ajax 5, so this is the second best uh, performance by Milovanovic. Serbest. In. And the second point by Serbest. Although just the second, but he played very useful since the beginning. Wide open for a triple, out. Uh, Stoic, now uh, Duvniak. Last minute of the third quarter. Inside the stoic, stealing the ball. Eriot Lou. Mm. 
Gönül. No three pointer. Stoic. Duvniak. Duvniak. From the corner, Vuleta. Stoic. Hard defense. Basharan out. So it's a seven points lead to Team Tofash Bursa. Ten minutes to go. If it's, it will be the last and no overtime. Plus one to the Tofash in the halftime. It was a six point lead, 39 45. Now plus one. And uh, they are still controlling the game, but the uh, Igokea. It's very dangerous opponent and their play, I guess, uh, seemed a bit better than uh, the than the first end of the first half. Duvniak with 15. Uh, Kurica with 11 and 10 points by Milovanovic on the other side. Engin and uh, Eriutlu, the leaders, they were there in the final last year. 16 by Eriutlu and uh, by Engin is 15. And 17 by uh, Postel. Dubniak. Nice triple that was. Eritlu, Postel, and Akman, and Postel, useful in the field as well, not just uh, when he scores. Actually, the, the organizers prepared already, maybe to motivate the players. Nice Achimovic two point. Here only one team can get the medals. The loser is just with the fourth place, with just the memories, but they can bring home. Hard defense, but it was. Fair enough. For triple. No triple. Achimovic is right there. Bouncing the ball. That's another chance for the triple. And that's for Gunul. Eriutlu. Akman. For answer, no answer. Kurija. Achimovic for two. He scores and one extra is coming. And one extra also two. Now he's with 13. And Achimovic's average point is 12.7 now. He is with full team. Two point zero, and it's uh, actually his sister. Our director, cameraman, know everything.
Perisic. Skurica, nice triple from the corner. Two points lead. Just two points. Now, Team Igokea arrived back to the game. Skurica, now he's with, uh, he's with uh, 14 points. Which just averages 6.3 per match. Uh, he scored the most against uh, Nimburg. It was 8 points. Now it's uh, 14, much better. They don't have uh, Radosic and Jovicic, two key players of the Igokea. That's why everybody needs to put more into the game. And uh, Topalulu, coach of Tofash, explaining what to change for the next 8.20. Because this is, that is the time what we have back. So let's see. Good to see that we have a wonderful uh, bronze medal game. Nice game, and it's uh, by Serbest. Duvniak. Kurija. Achimovic for two. Out. Good block by the center, Guleta. And he scores! Let's see the answer. Engin, Serbest, so close, it's out. And Guleta, then Team Igoka is going to equalize the game or to take the lead to take the lead Perisic first time in the match team Igoka is taking the lead seven minutes to go and one and a half quarter before it was 12 point to the Tofash now it's one point lead now Engin taking it back now it became a do or die match. Buleta. Oh, that was too huge. It was impossible to catch. Kuchokanovic. Position, Igor Kea. Perisic. Hachimovic. So powerful. You can't stop them. St stop him. One point lead to Igor Kea. Good to see that four minutes gone and just only one foul. The players taking care about the match, not to do mistakes and fails. Service nice. Uh, scores. No scores, but two shots. So Service the left the ball, catch the ball. And now the first team foul to Igokea. Akman has the chance to score twice. He has seven points. First is good. Perfect. 
two free throws. Substitution, Stoic is coming up. Losing the ball. Engin to Postel. Nice action, and it's in. Three points lead. Achimovic. Dubniakwo, what a nice trick that was, and Achimovic is right there. Now he's with 18 points. Postel has 19. The basket is good and one extra. Set best. That was the best receipt for them. To score double and one extra can come. But it's out. Akma gets the ball. Nice streak. Oh! Engin made a mistake. No one stood surrounding him. Answer, yes, with a triple. What a game we have to tie the game. 80-80. Postel, let's see the response. Engin, he was more efficient in the first half, let's say, and now it's out. Stoic. TV Goka. Oh, there's another mistake, yeah. By Dubniak. Engin, oh, no score. Dubniak, nice screen by Achimovic. Stoic, pass in. Achimovic, what a game that was! And at the last second, Andrei Achimovic scored a two-point lead to Igokea. Postel. Nice score. Efe Postel now with 21 points. 20 by Achimovic and Engin with a foul. Three minutes to go and nine seconds. Two, two team fouls. Milovanovic is a fresh player, just like Basharan. Kurija, Rishic, Milovanovic. Guleta, he likes that place, and there's another triple. Three points lead. And here comes the answer, who else but Postel. Both teams would deserve the win, I guess. And the bronze medal, Basharan. Easy point, pass back, maybe. He could have done it alone. Stoic to Guleta. Once more. No. But Stoic gets the rebound. Kurija. Team foul. Postel. Second personal foul.
Buleta. Pass in to Kurija in. Ten, uh, two minutes to go and it's two points lead to Igokea. Edutlu. The basket is good and one extra. What an excellent game we have. I hope we are going to have the same excited final as well. Exciting, decided. Erutlu now with 18 points. And it's out. 87 all. Dubniak almost lost the ball and out of bounds. Dubniak did the same just a half minute ago against Pasharan and he didn't learn the lesson. Pasharan is one of the fastest players. Not the best decision to make tricks against him one by one. Basharan. Stealing the ball back, Duvnyak, it was maybe a personal... Oh, good pair. Kurija. Oh, sorry, Vuleta, no score. Gunul. Basharan. Oh, it's Postel. Gunu, Postel, no score, good catch, good save. And white ball, 17 seconds on the clock. Substitution. Milovanovic and Djurjevic. Coming up. Gunnar out and Ergin. Engin comes back. Lovanovic. Kurija. Last minute of the game. If this is the last. Hachimovic. Milovanovic, no score. Postel, Engin, scores! And timeout, of course. Two point lead to Tofas Bursa. Maybe. They should have scored. They have to find out something if they want to save the game, maybe to an overtime. Because this is a, it's a do or die situation. Two points lead to Tofash. And maybe the last attack uh, led by Igokea, and after it, uh, Tofash will have the time. Free, free team foul, so they cannot do that. Just uh, pushing the each others, Radosic and uh, Jovicic. So they can't make fast falls.
very important defensive game is coming by the uh, Tofash and on the other side so so attractive uh, creative def uh, offensive play should be played by the Yuka Achimovic Dugniak the screen Achimovic Milovanovic to enter and no score and there's a foul they maybe they ask for a challenge or yeah they are asking for a challenge because maybe it's but no challenge so let's see bit far from the from the bronze medal they have to foul as fast as they can and after hoping not to score yeah as we expected two shots and then that was the tactics actually team Igokel said before the tournament and they want to defend the title and be champions again now they are far from the medal not about not the gold, the bronze medal. Hang in. First is good. And if he scores again, I guess the game is over. Captain of the Tofash. He did it and I guess now it's timeout. And let's see. Team Igokea came back from 12 points and then taking the lead as well. But it seems now that they could not live with the chance and save the advantage. And just uh, they, now they have 10 seconds to find out something uh, how they can change the game or to to the overtime I guess now they are fighting for the overtime not to win the game just to just to uh, survive some survive somehow and uh, then carrying the match to an overtime so exciting match so dramatic teams the winner will the winner will be that team who earned a medal from both of the editions last year and this year historic uh, moment could be that so let's see Milovanovic nice pass in blocked but See Dubniak. The score is good. Now timeout for Tofash. Two point. Yeah, it was uh, good tactics, I guess, from uh, the Eagle Kea. Now the it's up to the Tofash. Tofash, I guess, uh, will be stopped as fast as Igokia can then hoping to skip the free throws and uh, coming back with the with the attack first it's Let me 
huge discussion on the bench by Topalolu. And there's a fast foul against uh, Engin again. Last time he could handle this situation and could score twice from the two. Substitution, Serbest out. One in. First is good. Steel. Second is out, Achimovic blocked. And there's another foul. Achimovic got the ball but then lost it. This can be so tragic. It's in. And Achman felt. Achman read it. Galic is on the court and now it's Eriu Klu. He's with the 18 points. Set face by Achimovic. Second is in. Gentlemen, this is the final score. Team Tofash Bursa got a revenge, uh, give a revenge to the opponent team Igokea last year in Bursa. The home team, the Tofas Bursa, suffered a loss against the Igokea, and now they give it back. And uh, team Tofash Bursa, the bronze medalist of the tournament with a well-deserved win, actually, although both teams would have deserved the, the victory because there was a big fight how the Igokea came back to the match. But if you see, if we see the whole match, probably the Tofash uh, deserved it with one person more because they, they were so motivated and so uh, determined from the beginning till the end. Team Igokea, last year's winner, now with the fourth place, I guess, how I know them, they are coming back even stronger next year. And the Tofash, after a silver last year, get, uh, they get now a bronze medal. They are the bronze medalist of the tournament. Uh, we have a last match from 7 o'clock, uh, the final, the final of the final, versus uh, Ritas Vilnius versus Galatasaray. So two, the two Turkish uh, teams are on the podium. The first or the second, uh, the Galatasaray, uh, the second or the first, we will see from seven o'clock against the Lithuanian opponent. We are waiting for you at that time as well. Now it's a uh, bit more than one hour break and from seven, we are coming with the final of the Youth Basketball Champions League 2024 edition. See you then.